Okay, so thank you. What's up, Ithaca? We're Floodlands from Binghamton, New York. Uh, we want to thank you for listening tonight. All the songs that we're about to play tonight are off our album called Sia Saren. Let's have a good time. Let's have some fun tonight. Let's do that.
And now we have Floodlands. Hi, hey. Floodlands. Hey, what's up, hey, guys? What's up? what's up? So introduce yourselves and what you do in the band. All right, so I'm Tom. I play guitar and I do vocals and I mess up a lot. <laughs> and uh, I'm Jason. I play guitar and I don't do vocals mm -hmm. and I try not to mess up too much. I'm Jim. I play bass and I also do vocals on some songs. I'm Bill. I play drums and I try not to mess up. You did good. You did good tonight, actually. Thank you. Yeah. Thank so, you. So it's your job to mess up? Is that what you're saying? Yeah, so I get to mess up. Much. Nobody else gets to mess up. I see. Yeah. I see. Have, I you, don't think you have you crafted this? Uh, yeah. It, basically, this is what we did. Is Originally, I showed up, and uh, these guys were jamming, and they didn't want me in their band uh, because I was just <laughs> in, I just knocked on the door to practice space, and uh, I was like, hey, guys, and I was wearing a flannel. And that's the only reason why I'm in the band. Like, that's the only reason. Uh, okay. Not that that's actually true, but no. we're just going to go with that for tonight. <laughs> big, fan, big fans of flannel. Yeah, we're, we're big flannel fans over here. I see. Yeah. All right. Okay. You know, there's a, there's a flannel man thing, mm. like a paranormal thing where people really? will wake up and see a flannel man <laughs> really? in the room. Oh, that's awesome. You like on yeah. your chest, like one of those? <laughs> yeah, exactly. kind of... Sort of. It's a similar yeah. thing, except it's, usu it's, it's stuff, usually yeah. just in the room. Okay. There'll be there'll be a guy in flannel standing in the room. Oh. It's, it's, it's always Tom. Yeah, it's always me. <laughs> <laughs> See, I just like to sneak around and like, you know, weird people out in that way. You know, just, <laughs> that's understandable. Breaking and entering, whatever, you know. Yeah, Tom. <laughs> that, yeah, that, that's, Tom. It's yeah. a good exercise routine, it running is, away and not getting <laughs> caught. Of course, of course, you know. I do it like at least once or twice a week to, you know, get my stuts in, you know. I mean, this is kind of <laughs> Exactly, what I do. there yeah. you go. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, how long have you guys been Floodlands? We've been Floodlands since uh, October of 2017. 2017 yep. Has it really been that long? Yeah. Wow, yep. it's been that long. 
that long. Actually. That is crazy. That surprised right. me. I wasn't in the band then. So no, I was going to say, how many of you were in the band yeah. then? Yeah. Nah, so. I joined how long ago? In well, September. You joined in September, yeah. Okay, yeah. so that's yeah. not too long yeah. ago. Yeah, a few no, months. Not, you know, a few months. months. You know, probationary period. You know, right. just, it's, <laughs> that's why I'm wearing a flannel tonight. <laughs> that's right. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's why it, we took it the flannel. Why'd you take the flannel off, dude? It's getting hot, uh, You know, that's the merit there, you know. Oh, man. Where did the name Floodlands? Why? Uh, so Floodlands basically comes from, you know, the idea that we live in a river valley. And mm. personally, I'm really obsessed with geography and topography. And we're trying to write about things that are basically metaphors for things going on in our lives, but applying them to environmental issues. So mm. I felt like it was a good name to encompass all that. Fair enough. Mm. We're from Binghamton. It's been flooded, what, three times in the last 12 years? Uh, like 13 times in the past six oh, years. Oh, six <laughs> and... Uh, <laughs> 2011. Yeah. 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 Huh. It floods a lot, yeah. though. I, I was waiting for We Like the Sisters of Mercy, but decided to call it Flood Lands. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. I actually the, do. Oh, no. That's what Jim was going to say. I stopped Jim before he could say that. <laughs> That's a real story. <laughs> and, you, and you're from, all from Binghamton? Yeah. Um, all from Binghamton. Uh, I live in Binghamton. You guys still live in Endicott. I live in Endicott. Yeah. Yeah. Close enough. Binghamton. Big <laughs> difference. <you know? laughs> and how does, how does the music come together? Uh, basically, I just... You know, I bring a lot of riffs, like Jason brings riffs, uh, Jim brings, you know, riffs and vocal ideas, you know, Bill, you know, bangs on things, makes them sound good, <laughs> makes sure that we're not playing things Pretty too long it. or too short, you know, and then, you know, we just uh, craft it until we get sick of adding to it, and then we just like, oh, I guess it's all right, we'll just, we'll just wing it, <laughs> so that's what we do. What about lyrics? Lyrics, uh, that's... Well, that, well, you and Nick wrote most of the lyrics, I'd say. Yeah. Yeah, I guess, you know, Nick and I, uh, when, uh, our, our old guitar player, Nick, who was in the band uh, before Jason joined, uh, we wrote a lot of the lyrics uh, together. And then now, like, me and Jim are going to be writing a lot from this point yeah. on. So and Nick used to do vocals, and I don't do vocals, so it's well, kind of a learning curve for these guys taking over. What did dad. you do to Nick that made him leave? Uh, <laughs> he didn't have a flannel. I told him he had to get oh, out. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> makes sense. Yeah, he, he, he was yeah. missing a flannel, and then he, he tried to break into my house with a flannel, like the show. And uh, <laughs> He tried to pull a Tom move on Tom. Yeah, he, it, yeah you don't do that. That's not <laughs> cool. <laughs> I, I'm only, Tom is the only person in the band who's allowed to pull Tom moves. So. I see. <laughs> okay. He pulls a lot. Right. No, no, I, we love Nick. Yeah, yeah, Tom. Was, <laughs> yeah, Tom. Yeah, the only reason why he, he, he just didn't have the time to do it um, as far as the shows are concerned as often as we wanted to. I mean, he's incredibly talented. He had a big, big part of writing C.S. Aaron. And, uh, you know, we're, he's, he's a brother in this, uh, in this band for life, even though he's not playing with us right now. But he's, he's like always part be of part our of family. He'll <laughs> always be part of our family. Absolutely. And the name of the album mm -hmm. is Sea of Sarin. That is uh, Sarin uh, gas is uh, a uh, chemical that's used in chemical warfare. Um, basically, it's just a metaphor for uh, what uh, is happening to this planet, mm -hmm. and it's a concern of ours because obviously we only have one planet Earth, and uh, we do things every day to contribute to the pollution of the planet Earth. Uh, it basically shortens our lifespan as a species. So, um, I think it was a good metaphor for you know the songs and. Uh, you know, lyrical themes that we're trying to um, encompass in this band. Okay, all right. Um, where'd you record it? Uh, we recorded it at my house and Nick Donatello's house. house. Yeah. 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 Okay. And, and then, also our studio. Our, some of some of my stuff. Some, or some, some of my bass parts. Were, yeah, it was on, in the studio. I wasn't there for that. Yeah. Yeah. I had yeah, my flannel that way. Uh, that day, so, <laughs> so I wasn't allowed in the studio. But um, but yeah, uh, we did that. Uh, Nick uh, recorded a lot of it um, and uh, got it sounding amazing. Uh, and uh, what happened was is that um, we did some uh, vocals with uh, Mike Misha actually of Abandoned Studios. He's a phenomenal artist yeah. and a phenomenal uh, producer in his own right. And then uh, I took the album, I mixed it, and I mastered it. So that's... Nice. Mm -hmm. And it's available where? It's available on Spotify, it uh, iTunes, uh, Bandcamp, if you don't want to pay any money, which you don't have to pay any money, you should just listen to it. It's one of as many people to listen to as possible. Uh, Amazon, uh, all the usual outlets you can Google find. Google Play, too. Google Play as well, yeah. <laughs> nice. Google well, Play, YouTube. When did it come out? Uh, it came out uh, September 21st of uh, this year. Okay. Uh, actually, uh, not, I messed up. <laughs> I did it, guys. I did it. Uh, it's been four days if you don't four, remember no, yet. I, I, four days. I, I'm slacking here, guys. You know? <laughs> so actually, for the first time, I'll say it came out last year. That feels really weird. It feels right. like it just came out. Well, we're in the future now. Yeah, true. It's true. It's, just, so, it's true. what we do. You know, it's like time travel. Terminator. We're it is. Yeah, Tom shows up naked in the middle of places and lights go off and these but that actually happens time travels <laughs> <laughs> and uh, as far as shows have you played a bunch of shows uh, we've done uh, quite a few um, just in Binghamton right now we're working on getting shows all across New York State Pennsylvania
yeah. Mm. Um, we have a show coming up in uh, February with Kyoto and uh, oh, nice and Hearse. Uh, Hearse. Where's Hearse. that? Right. What's that? That's Where's that? Galaxy. That will be at Galaxy. Yeah. That's yeah. Okay. I had cool. to think about that for a moment. <laughs> <laughs> what's What's been your your best show so far? Uh, best show. I so think far. it's last week. Yeah, last week. Yeah. We'll go with the last. Or actually, what we just did here tonight, probably that was a lot yeah, of fun. fun. Yeah. Yeah. We'll do that. Some of my most favorite. I've never played in a radio <laughs> station. No, this is the first time we've done this. Neither have I. Yeah. yeah. So this is it was really fun actually. So I'm gonna I'm gonna say this show tonight. Okay, what was your second favorite? Second favorite? <laughs> the, oh, last the last show. The last show before <laughs> you know, I like to think we keep getting better. It's okay. just you know I'm just the eternal optimist in that way. I know I'm probably not right when it comes to that, but I'm I'm just gonna go with it. Yeah, the last show. We'll say that. Uh what what's been the weirdest thing that's happened to you in this band? Um I mean it's probably easier to say what hasn't been weird. I mean <laughs> I mean it probably I don't know. I mean my whole life is weird. I mean I'm gonna have you guys take that. What we had a uh, really obnoxious girl yelling at that one show. Oh yeah, I, I won't say the yeah, name. A... Oh yeah, <laughs> but uh, very obnoxious yeah. throughout our set, yeah. swearing, I, cussing. You know what I mean? Actually, um, I, I do have a weird story to say. So okay. what happened was we played Uh-oh. a show. <laughs> and you know what I'm talking yeah, about. Uh, so what happened was is that uh, she, uh, not she, but some guy came up to us after our set. This is the weirdest thing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, this is actually the weirdest thing. I think we actually finally came up with it. But um, this, this uh, guy comes up after our side. We're done. He's like, you guys are awesome. Um, and I'm like, oh, yeah, thank you very much. You know, did the usual. And uh, what happened was he pulls out his cell phone. He says, hey, man, I want to show you something. So he pulls out his cell phone. <laughs> and oh, apparently yeah, his wife uh, put two stickers um, in a bathroom over her you know, chest, we'll just say that. <laughs> her nipples? And, yeah, 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 we'll go with that. I didn't know if I could... You can say, say nipples, yes. Okay, well, nipples, all right, over her nipples. And he's like, hey, man, you know, check that out. And I'm like, <laughs> why? <laughs> I mean, I'm like, what, what is the point? And then this is what he says. Oh, can I get a free T-shirt out of that? I'm like, no. I mean, that doesn't. That's not how this. I mean, yeah, we're, we're we're a band that talks about topography and how we're ruining the planet by you know throwing things away. Yeah, I, I, we're totally into that. You know, I'm mean, gonna give you a T-shirt over that. That's exactly what we're all about. We're we're, we're Vixen from Los Angeles, California, or something. I don't know. Well, yeah, I don't, that, I don't think Vixen would have been into that either. They were all girl. Yeah, that's true. You know, I mean, well, who knows, I, man? Who I, knows? I mean, you never know. I mean, it's, it's you know. I mean, it's I mean, possible. it's a whole other can of worms. There, but, but no, Nelson. No, Nelson. We'll, we'll, no, we'll go with Nelson. Nelson, Nelson, Nelson will be. You're not Motley Crew. Well, uh, Motley Crew. Yeah, we'll say it's Motley Crew. <laughs> <laughs> but um, but yeah, I was just like, and he was really upset about the fact that I didn't give him a free T-shirt because you know somebody has all their. Uh, Organs and things that they should have <laughs> when they're born, you know, or, or when they turn, you know, twelve yes. or thirteen, you know, whatever that happens. You know? <laughs> so yeah, that I will say that was probably the weirdest thing. I, huh. I yeah. forgot about that. Actually. Yeah, I, the weirdest thing I think is you explaining it just now. Yeah, that's yeah. the weirdest thing. <laughs> that's right, I agree. So that's the new weirdest thing. So yeah, there you that's go. the new one. It's so cops because we talked about it. So yes. so where where is the best place for people to follow you? Mm, I'm gonna say Facebook. We're on Facebook. We're on Instagram. Um, we're on Twitter now too. Oh, we are on really? Twitter. Yeah. I, I keep forgetting we're on Twitter, so don't, I mean it probably hasn't been Ken, updated. Ken Maney helped us. Oh, Ken Maney, yeah, <laughs> Ken of uh, Ocho Duro uh, Par- Parley Hour. Yep. Uh, so he uh, runs a pod- podcast. And he's been super supportive of our band. Cool. Uh, so he helped us form a Twitter because we don't. I don't understand Twitter. <laughs> I don't I'm old. I don't. I'm just like I don't have a Twitter. I feel like it's a Binghamton thing. Nobody in Binghamton I know has a Twitter. I don't know if it's, 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 really it's against the law in Broome yeah. County. Yeah, yeah. I don't have one. They took it. You know, alternate side street parking, but it's really because you have a Twitter. You right. know? Yeah. <laughs> That's what it is. But but yeah, uh, I'm gonna say Facebook is best place to find us. Uh, Bandcamp if you want to listen to our album and or download it and uh, we're also on Instagram if uh, you can stand looking at our ugly faces so <laughs> all right and, uh, any yep. shows coming up yeah uh, so we're playing uh, with KO dot and uh, hearse again hearse yes yeah uh, at galaxy on February 28th and then we're gonna be booking a lot of shows probably within the next couple months all over New York City Pennsylvania so nice okay. they'll be uh, announced on Facebook if you guys decide to add us all right. Mm-hmm. Well, yeah. thank you so much for coming up thank and playing. You. Thank you thank so you much. much. Very thank much you. enjoyed it. Um, we'll, we'll get you a picture of uh, EVD here with your stickers over his nipples. Perfect. That's what I was hoping for. <laughs> yeah. That's why I came up here. <laughs>